Hello everyone, in this lesson we're going to look at the different ways that you can use the Windows Package Manager or the Winget command to bulk install multiple apps on Windows 11 and Windows 10. The Windows Package Manager is an amazing tool that allows you to discover, install, upgrade and remove applications on Windows using commands without going through the extra steps of searching online, downloading and installing apps manually. In this lesson, I'm going to show you three ways to bulk install apps using the Windows Package Manager without any external tools and other two solutions that make using the winget command a lot easier. Now let's dive into the steps to install multiple apps on Windows 11. But before, please subscribe to the channel and click the like button to help YouTube show this video to more people. It doesn't cost anything and you will be helping the channel and be supporting my work. Okay, first we're going to be using the winget command without any external tools and to do that, open start and look for command prompt or the terminal. Then right click the app and select the run as administrator option. First, we need to determine the names of the applications that we want to install on the computer. And to do that, we need to use the winget search command, and then we need to specify the name of the app or part of the name of the app to search against the repository. And for this case, I'm going to look for BLC to know the identification number. And in this case, it's video land that VLC and now let's going to do another search winget search and I'm going to look for the brave browser and we can see that the ID is is brave that brave all right let's just do one more and let's look for now let's do one more winget search and in this case I'm going to look for the patty application which is a telnet application and as you can see this is the id now that we know the ids for all the apps we need to use a left click and select the id and then on the selection just do a right click to copy the id to the clipboard and now we're going to build the command to install multiple apps at once and for that i'm going to open notepad and basically we're going to use the winget install and then we're going to use dash dash id equals and here you're going to paste the id number for the application and then use a dash e and then we're going to use ampersand ampersand space and then we're going to repeat the same command but now we're going to use but now we're going to insert the id for the next application that we want to install in this case the brave command And then we're going to repeat the steps to install a third application. You can make this as long as you need. Now that we have created the command, we're going to copy it to the clipboard. Going to go to the terminal. We can clear the screen. And then we're going to right click to paste it. And now you just need to press enter to bulk install all these applications. In some applications, you might need to agree to their terms in order to proceed. So in this case, we just need to type Y and then press enter. Now, once you completed the steps, all the apps are going to install on the computer. We can go to start and we can see that BLC is already installed right there. Brave is right here. And then if we look for Patty, we can see that it's installed right here. Now, if you don't want to type a lot of commands, you can also use the Winstall web app which actually connects to the Microsoft App Store repository and allows you to select the apps that you want to install visually. And it generates a script automatically, which you can use to bulk install apps on Windows 11 or Windows 10 using, using Winget. And to do that, you need to go to this website and then click on apps. And from here, you can, you can scroll down and select each of the apps that you want to install. And if you know the names, you just need to type them right here. And then just click the plus button to add it to your basket 
I'm just going to select the same apps that installed before. Once you selected all the apps that you want to install, just click the generate script button at the bottom right corner. And as you can see, it creates the same command that we built earlier. This page also gives you some other options. For example, the ability to convert this command into a PowerShell command. And you can also import this as a winget file. But for this video, we're going to click this button and then you just need to open start, look for terminal, run this as an administrator, and then just paste the command and press enter to install. And that's just a different way that you can bulk install different apps without a lot of interaction, without having to type many commands. So let me show you that if you actually download the batch file. Now, let me show you the uh, batch file. And when you download this file, the browser, if you're using at least Edge, is going to complain. But you can select to keep it and then save it as. Then you need to go back again to the menu select the keep option and then you have to go through all the steps because it thinks that it's malicious now in here we can right click the file select the edit in notepad and you can see that we only have the command which has only been saved as a batch file finally if you don't want to deal with commands and you don't want to go through the frictions of using a web app and then the uh, winget command in command prompt, you can use the dev home app, which is a developer tool, but anyone can use it. And among other things, it allows us to use a graphical user interface to find and install apps through the Windows Package Manager. And to do that, open start and look for the dev home app, and then just open it. This application is available on Windows 10 and on Windows 11. Then you're going to go to machine configuration, and then we're going to go to install applications. In here, you just need to find the apps that you want. For example, let's type the same ones that I've been trying to install this computer, such as PLC. Make sure to select the correct one and just click the plus button to add it to the basket. Now we're going to look for the Brave browser, and then we're going to add it to the basket as well. And one more, let's just do the same one, Patty. And then we're gonna click the plus button. Once you have all the apps selected, just click next. Then you need to check this option in order to continue. And then just click the setup button. And now the dev home is going to use the Windows Package Manager to download and install the three apps that we selected. And now when the process is complete, all the applications are going to be installed on the computer. You only need to click the done button to finish and you can close the app. Then you can go to start and you're going to find the apps that you installed. Let me know in the comments, which is the best option that will help you to install multiple apps on Windows. And that is all there is to it. Remember to like the video, leave your comments, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done that yet. And I just hope this video was informative for you and I would like to thank you for viewing.